my name is Claire Carmichael. Thank you so much for tuning in. And this is a vlog all about applying for your NMC pin, because as some of you know, if you're following on my Instagram, you've seen I finally had the email, which I'm going to put here. I finally had the email to register for my NMC pin, which feels like a long, long wait, but it's finally here. I've had to wait <laughs> to do this for you all because I wanted to record it and show you, take you through the process of how to apply for your pin when it comes to that point. So just a quick brief. So when you come to the end of your degree, you'll finish university, you'll get all your results back, you'll get your degree classification, which is the next step. It depends very much when your exam board is. So our exam board, even though I finished in November, our exam board wasn't until the January because there were still students making up hours on placement. They were still doing retakes and things like that. And we were still technically employed as well by the university in December. So our exam board wasn't until January. So it's been a very long wait for me, <laughs> it feels like. So then once the exam board is done, so our exam board was on the 9th of January. Then we got our results and overall classification all confirmed and sent to us on the 16th of January, so a week later. So, and then 24 hours later, we had uh, our emails finally from the NMC saying that we can register for our PIN, which is what I got last night. However, I was driving last night and I really wanted to do this video of you guys. Um, so I've been waiting all night to do this, to show you. I hope you appreciate it. <laughs> I finally had my email from the NMC. They will send you an email to your university to email you will follow the link in the email to register for your pin which is what i'm doing now so on your email it will give you your pin number so when you click the link from the email and you it will take you to this page here which is your nmc online you can log in if you've already got an email and password which we haven't because we're not registered yet or new to the nmc register so we're going to click that then i have an nmc pin we have an nmc pin because they've sent it in the email so on this page, you have to confirm your email address, your surname, your PIN, your date of birth. Obviously, I'm not going to show you this screen because that's confidentiality. So I'm just going to quickly fill it in now and then come back to the next page once I've filled it in. So once you've filled out the, that first page with your details, it will take you to this next page, which is to enter your account password, which is a new password that you're going to set up. And then the little exciting button, register. So we are going to register email vert oh so it's come up email vert verification check your emails and click on this link okay here we go let us check that oh it's there yes welcome to nmc online you'll use your account to update and maintain your registration online confirm email address done log in so lucky for you i've saved my email and password onto my phone so i can now log in <laughs> So now it's taken me through security setup. It's very thorough, this NMC. So I've just filled out the personal information on the screen that was before and continue to account, um, apply to register my qualification. So now it's taken me to a screen, expiry date, revalidation date, renewal date, all of that qualification, registered nurse, adult field. So I'm gonna click go to application Please indicate that you've registered and so it's now took me to this place that's just confirming um, all of your details basically tick yes next so the next page which I can't show you is got all of my address details to just double check all of your details basically add your mobile number which I'm gonna do now that's it I've done that okay above qualification is it correct registered nurse adult yes I declare I've passed the required examination for this qualification. Yes. <laughs> I declare I've successfully completed the required training for this qualification. Yes. Next. I declare the health and character are sufficient to enable me to practice safely in accordance with the code. Absolutely. Get me on that register, guys. <laughs> Have you received a police charge, caution or conviction other than a protected caution? No, I haven't. I've never had a caution. Um, have you ever been subject to a finding that fitness practice impaired by a body responsible no never been up for fitness practice i declare that i hold or will hold practicing appropriate cover yes i've got rcn cover already it's already due to be renewed for fully qualified nurse i declare oh please provide details of the professional that you hold okay um uh, professional membership 
So that would be Royal College of Nursing. Next. The NMC is committed to promoting equality and diversity in the workplace. Yep. Yeah. Please select one option that best describes your identity. So this is just basic monitoring stuff. Okay. You've declared that you have successfully completed your course. Yes, this is the final page, I think. Thank God. So qualification, you've declared that you've completed your course. Yep. Good character of health. Yep. You've properly declared any police charges. Haven't got anything. That's good. Um, you haven't been fit to practice, all of that. Declaration, is it above? Is it correct? Yes, submit. Thank you for submitting your application. You're required to make a fee of £120. Pay now. Finally, my payment has been authorised. Um, it just come up with a last one last screen to confirm all more details. So I can't show you that screen because that's my address and everything on there. But I'm just going to have a look at the emails now. So I have had an email to say your application has been received. What happens next? So they're going to process the application. You'll receive an email to confirm that you've been re registered and then you can log back on and check your status on your NMC online. So now it's just a waiting game again by the looks of it to wait for my registration. From what I've heard from other people it can take anything from an hour to a few days. Most people say within an hour or two your registration is live and you can actually see it. I don't know because it's Saturday if that makes a difference. I don't know or whether I'll have to wait till Monday. Who knows? But either way, by the time you watch this video, I'm going to be a registered nurse, guys. So yeah, so that's it from me. I just wanted to run through those things with for you so that you're maybe more prepared when you come to register with the NMC. So you're, you've got a little bit more knowledge on what to do and how the process is, because I know that's something I was asking all the time on social media and everyone was sort of like what do we do because no one sort of told us anything so I really hope that this video helps you out there and just get a little bit more prepared and sort of put you at ease and what to expect with registering online to get your pin so thank you so much as always for watching and I shall see you next time